tribal chief. The following contest is a tag team extreme rules match. Introducing first, representing the bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns. When you see a superstar like Roman Reigns, you see a man who seems practically untouchable. Exactly, Saxton, like a god, an immortal. He's achieved things that most only dream of. Just piles of championships. He made the long climb up the mountain and shoved everybody else off of it. The tribal chief of the bloodline showing off all of his hard-earned gold. And if you're hoping to take either of those titles, good luck. Here comes the Hall of Fame Fina. The most intimidating and imposing competitor in WWE history. And one of the most awe-inspiring entrances in all of sports entertainment. And from Death Valley, weighing in at 309 pounds, the The creatures of the night are out in full force tonight. Representing an unbreakable bond that the dead man has had with the WWE Universe for over three decades. I've seen this walk for 25 years, and I'm always in awe. The Undertaker transcends eras transcends sports entertainment. A true phenom in every sense of the word. Three decades of dominance. The dead man's wrath is unending. An unspeakable reign of terror over the WWE. This is the moment where there is no turning back for The Undertaker's opponent. Welcome to damnation. The Beast is here. Time for a beatdown, cowboy style. And from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 295 pounds, Brock The Beast Incarnate has been involved in some of WWE's biggest matches. 
He's always a spectacle to see in action. And there are undoubtedly more unforgettable moments on their way. It's time to do it the Cowboy way. He truly seems to enjoy combat. Of course, Cole, because it's what Lesnar was built for. The battlefield is his home. Yeah, Brock Lesnar relishes the chance to go out and simply conquer. Because Brock wants to be on the very top of the mountain. And he won't be denied. The animal has arrived. And from Washington, D.C., weighing in at 290 pounds, one half of the WWE Tag Team Champions, the Animal Batista! We can list this man's accolades all day long. WWE Champion, a Royal Rumble winner, a man who has main evented WrestleMania. And now Batista simply demands that the WWE Universe give him what he wants. success both in the ring and in Hollywood which is insane because for some reason the WWE Universe has never appreciated Batista quite enough well no question about it Batista will demand the respect of the WWE Universe right here tonight There's no telling what a competitor is capable of when they're battling under extreme rules. Oh, make no mistake about it. This match is high stakes, high risk, and high reward. A mistake here can take years off your career. Yeah, it's impossible to predict what kind of danger awaits because everything and anything is legal here, gentlemen. Oh, look at this here, guys. Look at this. That suplex into a power bomb. My goodness. Big forearm. down the opponent. Wow, Brock put a stop to that. Quick exchange, reversing the reversal. Power slam. Spine buster. Roman Reigns is having his way. Two suplexes. A third on the way. Climbs back inside. Powerful grip by Roman attacked in the midsection. This match grinded him down a little. Oh, colliding with a barricade. First out of the barricade. Oh, saw it coming and got an elbow for that. Oh, what power. Well, that'll do some serious damage. That spells trouble for Lesnar. 
This has got to be it. Makes the cover. And he makes the save for his team. Pulls their opponent in. Belly to belly. Big ball. He's got him here. He's got him up. And oh! Got to find a way to get out of this. Up they go. That'll jam your tailbone. He's looking a little off balance. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. He climbs into the ring.
Uh-oh, it's the red, white, and blue Thunderbomb. And Batista really looks battered after that attack. The head of the table will keep fighting until he has nothing left. Undertaker retaliates. There he goes, right into the corner. Oh, he retaliates. Right to the kidneys from behind. Headbutt to the back of the neck. And what's he looking for here? The steel chair. Never as innocent as it looks. Oh, a shot right to the kidney. Oh, and again. Great way to wear down your opponent. He leaves the ring, and there's no countouts in this one. He's got a kendo stick, a weapon we've seen used to great effect time and time again. He's back into the ring. He has truly gotten to a different zone, you guys. Helping to end it here. This is it. Gonna kick out in two and a half. Funny. Oh, God, be kidding me. The Undertaker just ended this. Well, what a save. The Beast and Connor looking to end this. Lesnar, elbow throw, saying not today. We're at a vital state. Batista with a pen. Feed off the WWE Universe. This place is starting to rock. Batista's looking to put the dead man down. Batista's bleeding. Coming back into the ring, back to the action. Oh, look at this. Raw power. Looking for something, anything under the ring. This bat is such a dangerous weapon in his hands right now. He may get the three count right here. This is it.
Well, they don't call it extreme rules for nothing, guys. Let's take another look. Here are your winners, Brock Lesnar and Batista. Brock Lesnar puts the finishing touches on this one for the win. Two men with one common goal can be a dangerous thing. They're putting the entire locker room on notice.